in this problem, a car is being pulled off by, a, by an engine force with a force of 2000 Newton and there's a friction force as well. And the friction force is 500 Newton and we know that the friction force always act to the opposite of the motion. So in this case, the friction force and the applied force this is the applied force and the friction force is acting opposite the magnitude of the forces are given now we need to find out what is the acceleration of the car what is the speed of the car after five seconds and we also need to find out what is the distance traveled by the car in five seconds let's do that so these are the given quantity. The applied force is 2,000 Newton. The mass of the car is 2,000 kilogram. The friction force is 500 Newton. And U is the zero meter per second. What is U? U is the initial velocity of the car. At this point, the velocity of, or the speed of the car is zero. That means it is a starting from rest. If I look into, into this direction, there are two forces acting onto the car. The one is the applied force and the other is the friction force. So according to Newton's second law of motion, F is equal to MA and this force is the net force along that particular direction. And in this direction, we have the net force is F, which is the applied force, minus this italic F, which stands for the friction force and equal to mass time acceleration. So the acceleration will be now the net force divided by the mass. The F is given 2000 and friction force is 500. Mass of the car is 2000. If we plug in, we'll get the acceleration to be 0.75 meter per second squared. And remember, the direction of this acceleration is along this way. Now let's find out the speed of the car after five seconds. So we know the kinematic equation V is equal to U plus AT. The V is the final speed. U is the initial speed, A is the acceleration and T is the time. We, going, we need to find out V and U is zero. Acceleration, we just calculated is 0.75 and the T we need to find out after five seconds. So this is the time five. So if you plug in, we'll get the speed to be 3.75 meter per second. So let's see what's the distance traveled by the car. And we're going to use this kinematic equation you can also use this equation too. V squared is equal to U squared plus 2AS. The V is this final velocity, U is zero. So you can also calculate from this equation. So it doesn't matter which equation you are going to use, you still get the same answer. S is the distance, the initial velocity is zero, half, Acceleration is, we just calculated, is 0.75. T is the time, which is 5. So if I plug in, the distance you get is 9.375. So it is close to 9.4 meter. So this is the distance traveled. So that's it from this uh, video. Again, if you have any questions, do not hesitate to write down your question in the comment section below sorry sometimes it does that and then do not forget to subscribe the channel and like and share as well thank you very much